Well, what's up, guys? Today we're gonna be doing a new reaction called Cartoon Logic that makes absolutely no sense. So just because we shouldn't like question Cartoon Logic, but we're gonna be questioning it because it just does not look like reality. So I'm gonna upload a new project video, like most likely like next month or two. But anyway, let's get started with this reaction video. We're going to be placing my little cam. Uh, how do I move this? Wow, it does not want to move. That goes. All right, so we're going to be looking at cartoon logic that makes no sense. Has anyone noticed those guys' mustache is in the wrong place? I thought his mustache would be, like, right here, like, under his nose. But no, it's, like, right above his lip. Shouldn't it be, like, right here where his nose is? Yeah, that's... But that's what that's why it's questioned. Underwater fire, yes. And SpongeBob, you should throw all logic out the window, because there's more things you can do. Like they're underwater, like there's no air, but they can still like set fires. Why does they have fire underwater anyway? They're underwater, but why do they have fires? I I we already seen this. I listen to music with eyes. F logic, yes. Why is he listening to music with his eyes anyway? Like I thought it was like for crabs, like this his ears would be somewhere like down here. Not up here where his eyes are. That's just like um I'm this is like me putting glasses on my mouth. It's not gonna make me see. Yeah, that's not logic. How the heck does this kid put his shirt on? Like his but the rest of his body is normal, like other than his face. Only his face has that big nose, but how does he put his shirt on anyway? Does he like put it like on like does he take it up put on from like from his feet? Like a dress? Probably. I don't know. He can't get out. Of course he can't get out. He's a his IQ is really dumb. Not like he could just tilt his hands down and he'd be free. But nope, he's on there for good. Multilingual age four. Who knows? Dora the Explorer. She could speak fluent Spanish. She could speak both English and Spanish, but she can't locate things next to her. She requires the map to get through everything. Like, where is the Nerf gun? Can you find my Nerf gun? Right here, we found my Nerf gun. Like, she can't locate things next to her. Like, why does she need the map to help her anyway? And then she asks the audience where everything is, when clearly it's right behind her. Eek, a mouse! It would be funny, because Minnie is a mouse, even though... Because she's also a mouse. Even Pluto was frightened because of it. Wow. Even though she's also a mouse, she's afraid of an uncivilized mouse. With ability to cure cancer, but wishes for chocolate snowboard. Yes, Timmy Turner, you have the ability to wish for anything. And you're going to have to wish for some that's completely unlogical. Chocolate snowboard. If I had, if I had the ability to cure cancer, like, if I had fairies right now. Like, I'm not saying I don't, but I might not either. But with the coronavirus pandemic, I would just wish that coronavirus pandemic out of the way. That way we'd be, like, going to school and everything. Has met Jesus multiple times, but is still firmly atheist. Now, that's a, I'm questioning that, like. Brian Griffin from Family Guy, he has met Jesus like multiple times. He knows that Jesus exists, but he's still an atheist. Like, why is he still an atheist even though he's met Jesus multiple times? That questions me. Lost the egg, sacrificed by some species in suicidal attacks. Well, it's not like you could just create three more eggs. You created three eggs, why couldn't you just create three more of them? That's probably what the Angry Birds is about. Yeah, have you guys played the video game? Comment below if you guys have played the video game, because I have played it multiple times. It's not even available on my iPhone no more, because Robio, the creator of the Angry Birds games, is not associated with Apple no more. But yeah, those I completed that game like a long time ago. Even better than one of my Tempest Shuffle games, where I got like almost all strikes. Why do they need to tiptoe past the professor when they could just float in the air? Yes, that is another question. Like, they can float. Why do they need to tiptoe past the professor? Like, they could just float in the air. 
Like, why do they need to tiptoe past him anyway? This must be the 2016 Powerpuff Girls. It kind of looks like the reboot of the original. Have you guys know the Cartoon Network has made a reboot without the original creator Craig McCracken? After he left Cartoon Network shortly after Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends ended? Guess you guys don't want Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends? It's a woman named Mount Foster who raises, who raises all these imaginary friends. She even has her own imaginary friend still with her, Mr. Heyman. That's probably why she created this place, because she still likes her imaginary friends, even though she's not outgrown them yet. He can barely lift soda, like Spongebob. He lifts stuff like teddy bears. He can barely lift those. But he can lift a car with one hand, flawlessly. Why does he... I wonder why he could only... He can only lift soda, like, barely lift it. But he can lift car with only one hand, like, flawlessly. That's like me, like, being able to lift my fork, like, I'm only one pinky. I can, like, lift it with the thumb, but... I can also lift it with the pinky, but... Spongebob can barely lift soda. But he can flawlessly lift a car with one hand. Why? Don't these people at Nickelodeon think that that's, like confusing to other people. Like, Spongebob, all those weights are like teddy bears. But for lifting cars with one hand, wow. That's Nickelodeon for you. That's about lies. What does Spongebob's sleeves, at sleeves attached to? Yeah, that is a question. Why are his sleeves, what are his sleeves even attached to? Yeah, what? But they're like floating in midair, but why are they, at they look like they're attached to something. What are his sleeves, at sleeves attached to anyway? In the original version of Spongebob, like, for season one, his sleeves were not even right there. They were, like, more down here. But as the show progressed, his arms got higher and higher. So in the, probably in, like, 2023, his arms would be, like, up here. He'd be, like, a little Peeps character. Drowning fish. Like, the, wow, they have drowning fish. All right. So they're underwater. Like... There's really nothing on the water. There shouldn't be anything on the water. No buildings or anything. But they're fish. And they're drowning in an underwater river. But why are they drowning anyway if they're already underwater? That kind of breaks the laws of physics. Like, they're underwater. Like, they're fish. But they're drowning in water. I wonder why. Even Patrick says that they can breathe water. Why? Why would Nickelodeon do this? Season 5 of Spongebob. More like season lies. Alright, they're under alright, this is another logic and the last one we're gonna be doing now. So they're underwater again. This is in the SpongeBob SquarePants movie. Like they're underwater, they really shouldn't be anything, but they have fire, they can cook food. They can they could swim underwater, they could eat burgers. And they could even take baths underwater. Even the movie they they just put the SpongeBob's pants are made of cardboard. How they're not soaking anyway. By the way, they're underwater. And why are they taking baths underwater? Like, they're underwater. Why is there water underwater? Like, there's even a scene where there's rain, too. Like, there's, they're raining underwater. Why isn't the rain, like, soaked into the water? And how are they taking baths anyway? And how's the soap even there? Doesn't soap harm fish? Why do they have soap under there anyway? All right. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want more of this, please sure hit that like button in the face. And you can subscribe to join my wall pack at any time. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye, guys.